hi guys welcome back to my channel so today i want to show us how to cut this asymmetric um dress i'll be showing us how to cut the upper part which um one side has the shoulder and the other side is um off shoulder so let's get started this is my already cut out pattern here so i'll just show us how i cut this on my pattern paper so first thing first you need to know how to draft a basic bodice this is my basic bodice pattern here so if you don't know how to start the basic bodies, I'll drop the link to my previous tutorial here on YouTube and on our website. So this is my basic bodies pattern here. And one thing is I'm working on the front and you should also draft on fold. Okay. Since the pattern is asymmetric in nature, you should draft it on fold. Okay. So now I'm going to mark um, at least half inch away from the center front there. And then probably one inch on the chest line if you want just to be wider you can do that then from the shoulder line I'll come down by probably five or six inches you know for the off shoulder parts okay so now I'm going to use my ruler to link the neckline from the shoulder parts here to where I want the insert to stop on the waistline okay uh so like i said it depends on how wide you want it to be okay if the half inch is too small you can increase probably three quarter of an inch or one inch it depends so i'm trying to trace the points i marked so that i can reflect on the other side okay so this is it here i'm just marking it i'm just marking it so now i'll link all those points together now so I'll first of all link the chest line to so I'm linking the side that has the shoulder okay I want to link it yeah so I'll just use my pen so I'll just explain to us what I've done now I linked I first of all linked the chest line to the waistline like so then I'll link the chest line to the shoulder with my cold driller then I'll just use um, then um, the other side that has the off shoulder I'll connect it like this then I'll also use the curve part of my ruler like so to link it to the 6 inch mark that I used to come down from the shoulder line so one side is off shoulder the other side is a um, normal shoulder okay so this is one inch difference and this is two inch gap you can make yours wider like i said before now okay so um while i was shooting i didn't even know that this part wasn't showing okay but um what i did was i, I came down by six inches from the shoulder line and now i want to create the star line for my yoke or my inserts yeah i think insert is more and uh, that's the right time to use so i want to create a star line for my insert like this you see that yeah i didn't know that the upper part of the pattern was not showing but there's really nothing yeah this is how it looks like can you see this is it here so our pattern is asymmetric in nature so any asymmetric pattern you're drafting it has to be on fold so i'm just shading my insert like so so now i'll just um label my patterns but before i do that i need to close my boss that for those of us that do not know how to draft a basic bodice pattern you can visit our website i will drop the link in the description box or you can watch the one available here on youtube i'll also drop the link but the thing is youtube videos you can't compare that to our uh, the videos on the website like it's a very far cry the videos on the website are more more detailed than youtube okay so you can watch the busy body tutorial from any of them either from youtube or on our website i will drop the link so i'm done cutting out the waist that now i want to also cut out the was that okay if you watch the basic body tutorial you should know that this is um 
like we've done this before you need to close the bust that okay so i'll just fold and then i'll use my masking tape to close it so this is it here okay now i'll just use my masking tape to close it up okay i'll just close it up like so yeah and then i can now separate my patterns right so i'll just label everything but let me just quickly cut out this part here okay now we still need to do one more thing for the off shoulder part we need to um blend but before we do that we'll use the front pattern to cut out the back since the front and back are asymmetric in nature okay so that's what i'm doing i've already cut out my back pattern so this is my back for the front i'll just mark three quarter of an inch on both sides like that and i'll reshape it like this so that to have a firm grip around the bust area so i'm just cutting out all my patterns now and i'm laboring everything so it's a very very simple tutorial i hope you learned one or two things on this tutorial if you did kindly give it a thumbs up leave your comment and reactions don't forget to share and most importantly subscribe thank you